Hey, it's the Scotch Test Dummies, and we got Basil Hayden's Malted Rye. Second Basil Hayden's. Go check out last week's Subtle Smoke, but this one's malted, and it's rye, and we're testing it. Different style intro, baby. Woo. Basil Hayden's twice in a row style. All right, we're in. That was good. With a little bit different. Malta, or I mean, uh, subtle smoke. We talked a little bit about Basil Hayden's, the, mm -hmm. the discontent, the hate. Mm -hmm. subtle, like a... subtle smoke. Well, no, not them. I'm just saying to, the the whiskey market towards oh, Basil 40%. Hayden's. Oh, forty percent. Yeah. Sure. Yes. Everything Basil Hayden does is forty percent. We'll make right. this quick. Right. We already talked about it. We talked about it every time. Yep. Basil Hayden's. We want forty five percent. We 45. want forty six percent. We know you're not going to listen to us. But we're going to keep saying it. I poured you heavy. <laughs> I figured That's still it, heavy. I Goodness. know. I dumped it in, baby. You were talking forty percent. I'm like, that You're means to you got to pour more. I'm trying to get me drunk. Well, see what I can get away with. Cliff notes. Subtle yes. smoke surprised us. We both it liked did. it. It was good. Yeah, and I came in probably a little bit negative. But low expectations. Good. Yeah, I've, I've got low expectations for this one. I'm trying to remember what I scored it. Eighty-eight. Did, okay, I was eighty-seven. You got were eighty-eight. It. Got it. Yeah. Not bad, surprising. Um, Basil Hayden's, you know, is, is a market pleaser. Yes. Uh, a lot of people new into the whiskey world go to Basil right. Hayden's. Yep. It's 40%. A serious whiskey drinkers want more. Right. I, I equated it to like taking a, a, a Ferrari driver, if you like driving Ferraris and Lambos. Hey, I got and then Honda someone, Civic. you know, gives you the Honda Civic. Yeah, but it's got a... It's but it's engine. souped up. Yeah, it's souped. It's got the turbo boost on there. <laughs> <laughs> now nice there's plenty and there's plenty of people that like Honda Civics. Sure, they're good. You had one for a long time. But anyway. I get, get the it. rye, right? If we you know, it. you know. Yeah, when you know, you know. I get the rye here. Ooh, it's like wow. a rye cream. Sweet, yeah. Right. Sweet. It's like a rye cream. Sweet orange citrusy rye. Right. Cinnamon. Yeah. Now this is the liquid cinnamon or the cinnamon you were getting extract. cinnamon yeah cinnamon yeah, this extract this is cinnamon extract yeah mm -hmm. before i had well on i the, thought it was cinnamon powders like cinnamon baking sticks you thought it was cinnamon jelly rancher right. on the cell smoke fire factory. what they called fire, fire back in the day it's good marketing tool sharp paint woo ha ha <laughs> sharp paint woo ha ha mm -hmm. the ring of fire <laughs> yes i know Ooh, ha, ha. Ooh, ha, ha. <laughs> it's the guy from Everyone Loves Raymond. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he did that voice. Can't remember his name. Put in the comments. Got it. Yeah, rye. Look, weaker. Yeah, I mean, it's it's definitely a sweeter. It's that rye, that orange, zesty, citrusy rye. Mm -hmm. But 40% um, is a little bit weak coming out of the glass. Not yeah. bad. Rye scares some people away. Just had a coworker tell me rye scares him. So a rye at 40% may, be, may not be a bad idea. Mm. Wow, that's a really good rye, too. It is, right up front. You can tell it's rye, that yes. citrusy, zesty. Citrusy, zesty, yet still robust. Fresh, kind of robust, a robust. Break, break, baked bread. Yeah, yeah, rising bread dough. Lingering in the finish. Almost a little dusty. It's good. Well, I'm actually going to go here. The 40% may help this one. Yeah, because rye can overpower. And it can actually have too strong of a bite. Yes. The 40% helps. Might actually right. stone in some of that down and making it more. I'll agree with you. I agree with you 100%. Because I just had somebody say, man, I can't do rye. And I'm like, really? That was what won me over to the American market early was rye whiskey. But because I like the strong peppers, I even like the dills that are in there. This one's more on a pepper rye note, but it's more of a rising rye bread. But that 40% has brought it down. It's really yeah, creamy, approachable. sweet, that orange sickle, yes. creamy rye, mm -hmm. slight peppery notes, caramels. Light floral hints of caramel and cinnamon is what they say. Yeah. True. Again, with the artfully aged, which I don't like artfully. <laughs> yeah. It means it's 
thrown yeah. in a cask yeah. and put in a warehouse. Yeah, some dude named Jimmy dumped it. Or or the warehouse manager's name is Art. Yeah, and he art fully did So it's Art it. yeah. fully aged. Right, yeah, that's the marketing. Um, <laughs> no, Art was a manager. Art, <laughs> Art! Name Art! What do you mean? That ain't All our whiskey's art fully aged, Artfully. right? Artfully. Yeah, absolutely. That's, we love art. He blesses each barrel. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Our, my whiskey manager, bar, or warehouse name would be Expert. Oh, really? Expertly, Expertly aged. aged. Yes. Yeah. Nice. Or Finesse. I'm trying to think. Finesse. Finesse. <laughs> hey. You in order to hire Any, you, you got to legally change your name to finesse. Anybody seen finessefully aged? Anybody seen finesse? Where's finesse? <laughs> Here. Where's Balake? Uh, <laughs> we had Basil Haynes up until then. Then we started. Sure. Walking yeah, and then they were like, "You we bastards! We out. hate you again." <laughs> <laughs> Love hate relationship. The dummies. Half the dummies. Anybody seen expert? Yeah. Where's expert? <laughs> <laughs> It's perfect. I love it. I love it. It's his middle name. <laughs> Again, kind of, you know, well, here's, here's the deal, though. Basil Hayden's really doesn't do bad whiskey. Mm -hmm. Basil Hayden's, the standard Kentucky straight bourbon whiskey, is good whiskey. Mm -hmm. It's just 40% ABV. Mm -hmm. It's lighter to us experienced whiskey drinkers. Uh, what's this? This is labeled Kentucky straight rye malt whiskey. Which so, is interesting. Yeah, not Kentucky straight yeah, rye whiskey. Right. When they say malt, K Kentucky straight rye malt whiskey. Right. <clears throat> so, uh, That's good. yeah, another nice bottle from Basil Hayden's. You know, I think in general we kind of discount Basil Hayden. It's kind of like, in fact, is we haven't picked up a few. Yeah, we. It's just not even been on our radar. No. Yeah, there it sits. And let me grab that one. What else do we got? next to it? So, right. Um, but this is, again, good. Yeah. I mean, as far as ryes go, um, I think this is in a very approachable rye. I love mm -hmm. ryes, but it does have that marshmallowy rye kind of flavor to it, which is very nice. Yeah, good rye the water. Ryes are not one of my favorites. I don't go to them that often. Okay, and I love I've got a little rye section over here. But... I mean, this one could be one of those mm -hmm. that I find myself going to more because it is more palatable. It's it not that young, sprightly, punch-in-the-face, peppery right. rye. Yeah. It's, it's smooth. It's creamy. It's, it's palatable. It's, it's citrusy. It's malty and orange and, yeah, caramels, cinnamon. Said. Yeah. Um, you know, rye was my first enjoyment of the American whiskey scene. I wasn't a big bourbon fan. Um, and I still like high rye bourbons, but this is really approachable. I would say cheers to our next warehouse manager. Beautiful. <laughs> Beautifully aged. And his cousin exceptional. Yeah. Is beautiful here today? <laughs> I don't know. Do we have exceptional? Where's exceptional? Exceptionally <laughs> aged. We should, we call him EP. Where's EP? EP, where are you at? You're a little slow, EP. <laughs> <laughs> What'd we tell you, damn it? Yeah, god damn it. Moving along, even though you're exceptional. <laughs> <laughs> Doing a great job. Keep up the good work. <laughs> well done. That guy, uh, that's that my guy, cousin. That guy's well, not going to last well, long. we're not hiring well done. <laughs> well, um, yeah, I know. You know, um, it's um, I like it. I really like. I it. don't. I don't like it as much as the subtle smoke. Okay, I like subtle smoke, but I'm going to go as a rye lover. I'm sticking with 88 here. Mm, I like it. 86. Okay, it's good. It's I good. really like this, but I lean Surprising. rye's anyway. Yeah, I know. I again. Oh, Basil, put out a 46. They're not going to listen. Right, so no. let's say it. We got to say it. Come on, 46%. 46, put out a 46. Uh, normal Basil Hayden's, the Kentucky Straight Bourbon Whiskey's, you know, 40 bucks. Most mm -hmm. of their special editions are 50 to 60, which is where this one lies. I think it's worth it. I think just like the Subtle Smoke, it's worth it. How much up. again? 50 to 60. Mm. Yeah. Yep. So it's you don't close. like it as much. Well, it's as close. The, you don't like it as much. The Subtle Smoke, you were God definitely you were more I know, I know I was, but I mean, I... Uh, Part of my problem is, again, I like rye. This is a great entry-level rye, but bring her down to 40%. Rye's are, come on. Mm -hmm. But when I get a rye, I like a, I, I got to admit, I like a rye that hits you in the face, but it's a good approachable rye. I just wish that they brought that price point down for this rye. Yeah. Rye's are, 
affordable. Come on. That's just my point. What if, your, what if your warehouse manager's name was sexy? Mm. Age. Sexually aged. <laughs> <laughs> what if it was dirty? <laughs> dirty. Dirtily <laughs> aged. <laughs> well, you, well, you wouldn't want to hire nasty. Nasty. As a warehouse yeah, manager. It feels unclean. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that doesn't feel good at all. What about... Uh, <laughs> sorry, that one was too dirty. We can't put that one in. <laughs> Let your Crusty. mind, yeah, throw it in the comments if you have some other adjectives that would be great to name your distillery warehouse, manager. Warehouse warehouse manager. manager. <laughs> Those like would art, be great. Artfully aged. Artfully aged. Scotch it. You scotch gods. We got to get out of here. It's a launch. <laughs>